Hey, what's up, guys? Rafi is my autograph haul from Colossal Con 2019. You see, I got a pretty good stack going. Pretty good. Would have more stuff signed, but unfortunately, Colossal Con introduced a new autograph policy where they'll hole punch your badge for one autograph free. For, okay, this is new. Basically, we're only allowed to get one free autograph from each guest for the whole weekend. So, let me one from Todd, one from Tia, and et cetera, et cetera. So, one, one free autograph each, and then after that, we have to pay. And if you have a hole punch, that means they know they already, you already got your one free for the weekend. So, after that, you have to pay, which kind of sucks because it was like the second time we went through this to another con. And uh, hopefully, you know, they should at least told us that in the program or in a post because, you know, that blinds, again, class always blindside people with these new policies out of nowhere. You know, it's not, you know. Not fair for everybody, that's what I'm saying, you know. So I had a good time, though, you know. It was cool, me and the guests are checking out the panels, and the Otaku Flea Market is always my favorite thing. So, again, I wish they let us know ahead of time, you know. Some of us could save a bit more, more money for more autographs, but I'm okay with the stuff I got signed, so let's get started. Uh, is this year for guests that they had on J. Michael Tatum, Tia Baller, Natalie Hoover, Trina Nishimura, which was a big one, uh, Lindsay Seidel, another big one. Uh, Jeremy Ingman and one of them and Amber Lee Connor was added like last minute because of uh, Eric Vale cancel so pretty cool that we had another additional guest and Shark Boy he's one of the other guests I was excited to meet too but I think I start off for Natalie Hoover I got her sign by copy of Lord and Magna Made of Heavens I will say that it was cool her and Tia Battle were only charging five bucks after which was cool because that's the cheapest everybody did. Everybody else was like twenty, twenty five, twenty to like thirty dollars, and eh, I get it. They need to make money. I get understand, but that's still a lot of money, you know. That's that's my, that's my opinion, you know. Uh, for another, again, another thing for Natalie Hoover got her side Akiba strip, which I actually bought at the flea market. So like, oh, I find, oh she's in this. So I gotta get her to sign this. Uh, for Jerry Eggman, I signed my copy of Yu Hakusho. Because he was uh, Goki and Zusaka. Zusaka, or something like that. I can't pronounce the name. Oh, she was excited to see this. Natalie Hoover, I got her, brought her uh, Gargantia. Very underrated show. Everybody got to check this out. Very awesome. Uh, luckily, I did have something for Amberly Connor because the time we got to the con, we found out she was at it. Like, oh, but luckily, I had my Keijo, so I had her sign my Keijo. Pretty cool. Oh, it's running out of space already. Uh, for Tia, I had to sign my copy of Captain Cuties. For J. Michael Tatum and Natalie Hoover, I had to get my Princess Dry sign, of course, because a lot of the mains right there. I, I think I got almost all of them. Oh, for Tia Ballard, I had to get Sanka I love this show. Finally got her to sign this. And also this show as well. My love story. Very happy to finally get that sign from her. And my main thing for Trina was going to be Bento, but then I found out she was in another show I really enjoy, And I had to get her as uh, My Brides a Mermaid. She was one of the main mermaid girls, which I needed. You know, I got it. That's the thing. I had the most signature, and I really loved the show. So Bento had to take a backseat. And then from Shark Boy, I got a uh, signed autograph print for like five bucks. Going to pass that up. But also with a picture. And for Todd, and I got him to sign... That wall scroll, Devil Survivor 2. Right there, he was Jungle. And for Lindsay Seidel, I had her autograph my Steins Gate wall scroll. But yeah, guys, that's been my autograph haul from Colossicon 2019. Again, we still had a good time. Sucks about that new policy last minute, but we still had a great, you know, again, it was great meeting the guesses. It was great to have time for actually going to panels and of course the taco flea market you'll see in my haul for that video uh maybe in a couple weeks or so but i hope you guys enjoyed my video this is a raft five i'm gonna attention to go go goodbye